in this video I'm going to show you how to differentiate a uh, arc sine or inverse sine function so uh, let me write the question so y is equal to say sine inverse x and I want to differentiate this okay so the question is differentiate differentiate this function okay uh, I'm not going into the graphing of sine uh, inverse function so here yeah, if y is equal to sine x I can write x is nothing but sine y okay now differentiating with respect to uh, you can differentiate with respect to y so you can say d by dy of x is equal to d by dy of sine y so d by dy d by dy of x is nothing but dx by dy is equal to differentiation of sine y would be cos y okay so this is nothing but uh, this implies if dx by dy is cos y dy by dx is 1 over cos y okay now uh, let me leave this aside so let me go back to the uh, this x is equal to sine y i want to write cos y in terms of x okay so this will become if you square both sides can i say x squared is equal to sine squared y so you can say x squared is nothing but 1 minus cos squared y if you make cos squared the subject cos squared y is 1 minus x squared therefore i can say cos y is square root of 1 minus x squared so if i know cos y is 1 minus x squared i can say this implies so let me change color finally your answer is this implies uh, dy by dx is equal to 1 over square root of square root of 1 minus x squared okay so here dy by dx of this is this okay so let me do one more question how what is the uh, differentiation of uh, say tan inverse of x I think we have done that so let me differentiate okay so let me write differentiate in the previous video we do, did the differentiation of tan inverse of x so the, if the question is what is the differentiation of cos inverse of x the process would be the same so let's write that so this implies x is equal to cos y x is equal to cos y so here again the same thing dx by dy is equal to negative sine y dx by dy is negative sine y which implies dy by dx is negative 1 over sine y okay so i want to change this sine y in terms of x so what do we know so we know let me change color so x is equal to cos y that is x squared is equal to 1 minus uh, sine 1 minus cos squared y i'm squaring both sides uh, okay so let me do one more step sorry so if you square this side if you do cos squared you can write this is x squared is equal to cos squared y so i can say x squared is equal to 1 minus sine squared y okay so sine squared y is 1 minus x squared okay so sine y is square root of 
1 minus x squared. Okay. So finally, therefore, I can say that dy by dx in terms of x is 1, negative 1 over square root of 1 minus x squared. Okay, so the derivative of this function, if it is cos inverse of x is negative 1 over 1 minus sine squared. And when it, if it is a sine inverse of x, it will be positive. See you in the next